Huh. So did you really think that I wasn't going to come back here and get the gold before somebody else? No, that ain't happening. Let's get some gold. I'm ready to go. How about you? then I'm at the spot and nobody's been here gotta love it so working with bucket classifier shovel I made myself one of those uh, baster sucker thingies put a tube inside of it brought it up so far got me a silver literally a silver spoon that I found in the river my spade shovel a little crevicing tool pry bar a little sweeper brush and an empty snuffer bottle. Yesterday I didn't start with an empty one, but today I am. And of course my gold pan. I did not bring a gold trap in with me today. I'm just gonna pick these things apart. That piece can still come out of there. That piece can still come out of there. There's a bunch that can still come out of here, I'm sure. I mean, even that big one, I bet you. And who knows how much further up and what we're gonna find up in here once I start cleaning that out, these will break out. So I'm expecting to get a decent little haul of gold today. Just panning. So let's see what I can do. Catch you in a bit.
<laughs> so that's uh, just a half of a five gallon bucket. There's little micro dots in there everywhere. Have no idea how many pieces it is considering the micro dots that I'm seeing that you're probably not seeing. I'd say well over a hundred easy. And that's just like I said a half of a five gallon bucket. And my uh, my sucker tube is a no-go because I heated I heated this end up this end here of the metal tube to stick it up through and I failed to check it before I left the house and it's got melted plastic plugging that end so no go and I tried using my uh, sticking that down inside this end and picking it out but it, w it wouldn't work so silver spoon it is I haven't even scraped the bottom yet that half gallon or that half of a five gallon bucket I just took my shovel and scooped out that hole there I've washed broke a bunch more out and washed all of this right down in there there's still all this material up in here and a lot of these pieces will break out easily once I get to digging I know that uh, that these pieces will probably come right out of there no problem that one will come out so yeah there's still there's still a lot here a lot of material here left those pieces up in there probably come out at least that one and that one so I'm liking it and it's not supposed to rain today but it sure has gotten uh, kind of cloudy but that's alright so I'm not gonna film everything like I said I started with an empty snuffer bottle so I will show you the end results catch you in a while alright so I just scraped the bottom of that one the best I could with my scoop and then when I got as far as I could with that I did it with a silver spoon one pan whoa slip sliding away one pan That's better than the half a bucket. And that big piece up there looks like a heart. There's micro dots in there, and bigger ones and smaller ones. Still a ways to go. Loving it. Next pan. Focus. And next pan. Sweet. Now I'm beginning to wonder if I should skedaddle. It's not looking too good. And I'm not in a good place if it doesn't get too good. Water has nowhere to go. Tip number one in high water, swim with the flow, not against it, because you'll drown. All right, I'm a crazy guinea, so I think I'll do a little more. <laughs> and next pan and they're getting smaller it's uh, pretty good chunky piece there I'm up on the uh, the shelf now and there's pockets in here too mm. yep I don't know how much more I'm gonna do still not 
looking the greatest. Alright. One way or the other I'll catch you in a bit. Alright, so it's just getting darker and darker and I'm going to call it for the day. I could have done a lot better if the, the weather report was accurate. But oh well, you win some, you lose some. But I did have a good day. That's not bad at all. Not bad at all. I don't know how well that's focusing. Very nice. I'm happy I had a good time. I got out. And I, I think I've got this pretty darn good and cleaned out. I couldn't get those rocks out of there. I just, there's other ones pinning them in. So, oh well. And I, the only thing I didn't get was just this little spot right here and maybe up in there. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like and share and all that stuff and comment. Green Mountain Gold Trap is done for the day. See ya.